Hiya, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Rosie Henshaw. If you're new here, then welcome. It's lovely to meet you. And if you're an existing guy, then thank you so much for coming back. Um, so grab yourselves a nice cup of tea and some snacks. Mine is a water again, because if you watch my videos, you will know I am struggling with a heartburn, guys. And water is the only thing that doesn't seem to irritate my heartburn at the moment. But we are really getting nearly there with Bubba Boy at the moment. So that'd be nice. So today's video is a bit of a mashup. Um, so I've been doing it, we're decorating in the baby's nursery. So we had the old, um, used to be Millie's bedroom, but now she's gone up into the loft room and we've had that decorated. So that's pending a reveal. And we're just waiting for her mattress to come. But in the baby's room, it's not quite finished, but we've bought his buggy. I've had a few people ask what buggy I've bought. I got a complete bargain. So I wanted to share that with you. And also the old wardrobe that was in there, I've stripped that down, painted it in a lovely bright color. Got a few of his little bits hanging up now. It's all been like sanded, prepared, and we've also had his room decorated. So I thought I'd do a little mini update, show you my bargain buggy as well. And also as well, this is in collaboration with HelloFresh. So I have actually been using HelloFresh for the last two and a half months. Um, anyway, myself, I've actually been finding it amazing. So we got recommended via one of Gary's work friends to use HelloFresh. He's quite into fitness and health and me and Gary were a little bit dubious. We thought, no, we're not them kind of people. Then we actually realized it's just super, super convenient. So it's for everybody. Yes, they are balanced meals. Yes, they do come in perfectly sized portions, but you aren't left feeling hungry. They really are good. I think they're such good value for money, really, because I never have waste when I use them. I'm the sort of person I end up chucking waste from the fridge. And I get a little bit confused as well as what to cook for meal times. And um, so I find that when it comes to HelloFresh, the meals are there. You can pick up to 35 different recipes each week, which I think is fantastic. So the three that we've actually had come in, I'm going to unbox it and show you how fresh it actually comes so you can get a rough idea. And I've also got a discount code for you as well. And that will leave that in the description box and that will enable you to get 50% off your first box with them and then 35% off your next three after that. So when it comes, it all comes readily prepared. It's even got like the neighbor, like the number descriptions on them to go with um, all the bits. We had the two people delivery. Reason being is the children sometimes can be a bit fussy. So we're gonna cook them different dinners, but you can get these for four people as well and they double up on the ingredients. Um, and it all explains on the back card how to prepare them. And they come obviously with the assigned number so you know what's what. But what I really like about it as well, in the bag, they also come with like this special fridge bag that has ice packs in it and everything that can be recycled, um, which are brilliant. And that keeps all of your meats fresh. They're currently in the fridge, but these will have all the spices and stuff inside them. And I'm gonna open one tonight, the one we're cooking, and I'll show you how it all comes. So I've unwrapped everything, and this is everything ready for the spicy creamy chicken pasta. So we've got the tomato passata, we've also got the shallot and garlic cloves, loads of like tender hot spinach, tender hot spinach, I don't know what that is, baby spinach. Um, and it even comes with all like the ingredients. So the chicken is super fresh. So this is diced chicken thighs. We've also got the creme fraiche here, the grated hard Italian cheese, and it even comes with all the spices and the chicken stock and stuff that you're going to need. You will literally only have to add water to these. And yeah, we've also got the pasta, but that's boiling up ready. And I'm gonna fry off the chicken as it says per instructions, add the chicken stock and the spices, and then we actually use this sauce with the creme fraiche and the cheese to make the really creamy tasty cheese. Oh, honestly, my mouth's watering. So I've just added the spinach because um, I've fried everything off with the onions and the garlic and the spices and the stock. Um, so I'm just adding the spinach to whip that down now. Um, and then I'll be adding the creme fraiche and some of the hard cheese and then it just goes super, super creamy like this. And um, there's a good chance Gary might not be getting any of this. I might actually eat it myself. Who knows? Because technically I am eating for two. Um, so, and it says it serves two people. So it's probably gonna be for me and baby. But you know, if Gary gets home before this is served, then he might be with a chance of actually having some of this. <laughs> So this is how the spicy creamy chicken pastas turn out. Honestly, if this was smell of vision you would be able to smell how amazing this is um, and it just tastes amazing. Definitely, definitely worth a try. So this is Millie's old bedroom. We're now turning this into the nursery that is loving life on the windsill watching the world go by. <laughs> 
Um, so as you can see, there's Artex wallpaper on the ceiling, um, like what Artex style wallpaper. So that's always obviously got to be stripped. All the wallpapers have got to be stripped off the walls. Um, we took the TV down. It's just literally a bed in here now. We even took the four poster part off her bed for the curtains and stuff. And um, just kept that on to protect her mattress. Um, and the decorator is currently up in the loft room doing Millie's bedroom, her new bedroom. So this is the wardrobe that was in Millie's bedroom and we will be sanding this down. It's got really bashed as we're trying to get everything out and that really chippy. Um, I would normally have sanded this and gone over it, but there is no need. So I'm gonna strip this right back. I don't know if it's go for bare wood or sand it right back and paint it. Um, but we're gonna get it painted, new carpet, new plug sockets. And then, yeah, because we did say that upstairs we'll have a little makeover everywhere now with all the plug sockets, electrics carpets and a little bit of paint sort of to match now downstairs has been done didn't want to get it done before then because of all the dust and the dirt it would have been a bit pointless a bit of waste of money um bertie hello who's going to the groomers who's going to the groomers you can barely see this is what it looks like now we've got like a greeny color on the walls now this is actually called oval room blue by farron ball let me shut this door because kids are showering and um, Gary's getting them showered because we're off out today because it's actually Gary's birthday um so we went for this color it's Farron Ball called Oval Room Blue in certain lights it looks gray in a lot of lights it looks green um and then sometimes it can be blue depending on what it's next to and um, so we ended up painting the wardrobe and we painted this in India Yellow by Farron Ball but I get all my paints mixed up by um Valspar being q <laughs> the kids are all excited but I even painted the inside this was a pain in the bum uh, the leftover paint off and um, but we folded all these clothes they've not been washed or anything yet they've just been put away um which we will do that nearer the time just in case with dust we are going to be replacing the carpet in here i'm going to be showing you the buggy as well so this i ended up getting the ickle bugger bubby ickle bugger <laughs> Ickle Bubba Buggy. <laughs> um, and I ended up getting this for £179 off of the Audi website. Um, yeah, you heard that right. You know, like little, little and Audi, like Audi website is one of their special buys. I'm going to set it up and show you in a second. But it's actually a travel system. It comes with a car seat and um, it goes up to three years as well because it's got the proper seat as well as the baby carry cot. Um, so I picked up, this was the first thing I ever bought when we found out I was having the baby. So this is the little, um, this is called the Reva changing mat. It is a little bit pricey. I've got this from the website Ollie and Ella, um, but we are going quite bargain hunting in here. The, the cot we've got is actually going to be going there and it's from um, Ikea. That was £70. And um, we've got these little basket from a company called Belly Bambino Baskets, which I thought was so cute. Um, and then also shut the blind so you can see a bit better we've got this um little hanging macrame rainbow and this is actually from a company called cope rainbows on etsy so i will put all the links below in the description box um and i think this was 12 pound but they're all handmade um and then as we go over We've got from Florian and Olive, I think the company's called This Little Lion. Um, so I thought he was really, really cute off Etsy. So I'll link that below as well. Um, and I also ordered this from Etsy. I can't remember the name of the company I ordered this from, but I will put all the links below. We had the name Wild, which obviously isn't the baby's name. Um, <laughs> but yeah, it was really weird because when I ordered this, we had no idea we was going for the colour in the room. But as you can see, it's this sort of sagey, sort of like sea foamy, greeny blue sort of colour. Um, so yeah, you can get different coloured lines for this, like mustard, pink, beige, and the green. So I just got the green because we didn't know what we was having at that time. Um, so I'm going to get the buggy out. It will sit up now and you can see. Um, I've put the carry cot on this way just to show you can obviously turn this around once it is like an adult. Um, not an adult, but like an older child sitting up. Um, so the carry cot, I will click it, take it off because it's got these little click buttons. Literally lift these buttons at the side and you can click it off and then turn it round. Um, but the frame is so nice. It's really, really lovely. Nice and spacious basket um, and the brake. And you can obviously get the feet and the handles adjusted. Um, also, it comes with this little seat here. So what happens is, is this little carry cot unzips. This bit goes inside and then it becomes like one of them really modern looking sleek buggies for when they're a little bit older. Um, but obviously you can put the car seat that comes with it 
on it as well so if you're busy like i will be on the school run i will literally just be taking him out of like the car seat out of the car clicking it onto the frame and then taking him into the school like obviously that's a very short journey because it's not safe for long journeys they say um but yeah it would just literally be from the car to the school gates um, but yeah, it's also got the little liner as well, which you can zip up over the top, which just looks really, really cute. It also comes with a, um, also comes with a rain cover and a little netting as well for like gnats. And it also comes with the bar that goes over as well. Um, you can get these changed. You can order from Ickle Bubba and get these in like a tanned leather. Um, or I don't think they do other colours, but on the Aldi website, so this is the V Stomp 2. I believe, yes, yeah, Stomp V2 of the Astral Car Seat. Um, and this literally cost me £169. And on the website itself, they're still £499. Um, they do have newer models on there. And I was going to go for like the dark green colour originally. And I was going to go with the tan leather strap. But then when I thought the amount of money we'll save just for going for the black one instead. Um, so it's definitely worth it. So I got this one instead. They also had this in a dark grey on the website and also in a light silvery colour. It's in a really nice wipeable material. Um, this has all got a flap over. I've just not got it all prepared out the box <laughs> properly. Um, but once it's done, it does. It actually does look really nice. A few of the mums around the school um, that have got younger children and babies have got these and they do look really stylish, especially once the carry cot stage is over. So like once they're like four months old and you put the modern bit on it, it does look really, really sweet. If you type that into Google, it'll come up what it looks like. It's just really, really nice. Um, but obviously, I will end up unzipping it all, <laughs> having to redo it for baby. So this is the progress so far that we've got going on. I wanted to sort of do a whole complete room reveal because we've got loads of lovely little accessories and DIY bits that we've done um, to go on the wall. But obviously, we can't do that yet just because we're waiting for the cot to come and Ikea messed us about a little bit with the deliveries. So everything will be set up in here and I'll do a proper reveal at the same time that I do Millie's room reveal and make it a bit more of a bulky video. Um, so yeah. This is his room. So I really hope you've enjoyed this video, guys. Don't forget as well, the description in the description box, there's a code in there as well, which gets you 50% off your first HelloFresh box and then 35% off your following three boxes. Um, definitely worth it. The food was amazing. And um, I'll leave any links in the description box as well below to anything that I can that I showed in the baby's nursery as well. And um, yeah, I'm just really looking forward to that being done now. Completely finished. I will do a complete show you a haul of it all of it a reveal of it when it's done because i do so many holes guys that's a problem and um, when i do millie's room as well but obviously like i said earlier waiting on the cot and the mattress then we can add a few of the accessories that we've bought up on the walls there's no point getting them out at the moment um, and then millie's room will be ready once the mattress is here too so i've been rosie henshaw take care see you later bye